Shout out to the Christ James. Yo, it's getting it, man. Let's do it big. It's called the essence of a real black woman. The essence of a real black woman is strength in epic proportions, not watered down or distorted, confused or contorted. The image portrayed should be aborted, sorted out like mail in the post office. While Michelle holds a high office, those with no mind are walking coffins, often not realizing their strength is their mind. Blind to reality, a real black woman's salary is unknown. A queen is assessed by the king on the throne, but some queens stand alone by strength, a gift imparted by God to stand. Stand in the face of adversity, stand when they feel unworthy, stand when they are thirsty for a drink of relief, standing in their belief that their strength will bring them through. But those who say strength is the essence of a black woman, not who, but what is the question. That should be confronted, from being dehumanized to sex objects, to speaking to Senate and Congress. From being prostitutes and drug addicts to millionaires living lavish, the world's savage assassination of the black woman's essence should be a lesson. Nothing formed against her can win. No, not one weapon. Her womb is like the universe. It has God's created life until the big bang of birth, which brings forth a marvelous life that can sustain a people, a nation, a world. The essence of a black woman is more precious than pearls, diamonds, gold, any jewel on earth. Because she brings forth the black man in all his girth. The weight of the world lies not on her shoulders, but in her heart. Because the love she gives is unconditional and can never be set apart from God's love, which are one and the same. A scientist couldn't explain the molecular structure of her game. But one who knows her aim is to shoot far beyond stars. Know the essence of a black woman is strength in all parts. Price.